ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the continuing saga of Drool Drink Tanya here on Down the Waterhole, where drinks are drunk. Next up on our interesting range of British drinks that are unique yet unusually commercialized is a drink that's roughly 500 years old. Roughly 500 years old at least. So, with that set in mind, this is one of the oldest British drinks to ever exist. It's been around since the Middle Ages. It is, a, it is a combination of fermented. It is a combination of fermented flowers and something called burdock. Yes, folks. Today's drink is the legendary dandelion and burdock. Americans would have no fucking clue what this is. This is a drink that's been around for nearly 500 years, and it is a traditional drink here, alongside Clary Lemonade, which we have sign signature and made alongside bitter shandy. And ginger beer. So let's give you the steps of this one, which is in terms of this, which hasn't really got much to look forward to, which has only got colouring, citric acid, sweetener, flavourings, including dandelion and burdock flavouring. This is probably going to either be or great or terrible. So, let's open this bad boy and see what this cell smells like. My feelings are suck. Let's have a smell. Artificial flavor, though. Hmm. Yeah. If you're wondering what doing the dandelion and burdock is, but dandelions is an actual flower. You ferment the drinks, ferment the dandelion, and then add the actual burdock. So, <sighs> this is dandelion and burdock, ladies and gentlemen, the 500 year old drink. I don't like the taste. I didn't like that taste at all. I think the, I think the bird overpowered the dandelion or whatever that's supposed to be. That's not a good drink. I mean, I can see the appeal of the drink, but not for me. It's a terror. It's not a favorable drink. Two out of five. It's except it's it's something I'm not gonna have again, but it's acceptable. Um, I'll snung ends the show for now. I'm I didn't like that talk at all. I feel I'm gonna give this give this to my old man. He'll probably enjoy it more than I could. Anyway, I'll see you all in the near future. Peace.